something. Yeah, right? We all been through something. If you ain't clap or say something, you just take some time to think about it. So it's all good. We're going to have some fun tonight. Here we go. Never lose your smile. It's the one thing that makes you special. You got to learn to smile even when life gets stressful. Know that every smile is different, but we all smile the same. Your smile can be the one thing that helps get you through your pain. Because trauma is one of the scariest things as a person you can ever go through. But sometimes it's a necessity of life that we all must grow through. See, when I heard one of my best friends got killed, it almost killed me too. See, life doesn't have to kill you physically, it just has to control your mental. And if you let it live inside of your mind instead of being just a rental, the effects can be detrimental. So always remember that trauma is temporary. It's not written in pen, it's written in pencil. So you can erase all of the bad times you've ever had. All you have to do is flip the trauma on its head and stop letting it write in the pages of your life with this poisonous lead, but be led by the things that it's teaching you and the lessons you've learned. Because you've made it through the battlefield of life, your stripes you've earned. So take those pages out of your book, set them on fire and watch them burn. And don't let it hold you back no more. Take his ashes and put them in the urn and drop it in a pit at the point of no return. Because your trauma, it only defines what you became. Not what you can become. Just because you feel weak right now doesn't mean that you don't have the strength to overcome. All you have to do is take a step back and look at all you've done. Keep the good of life playing in your mind because joy and depression can exist at the same time. And that's a rule of thumb. See, I know you have the strength. And it's very deep down within. Because if a little girl who was raped can get back up again and still walk through life with their head held high and still believe she can win, imagine what you can do if you just believe it was written in pencil and not in pen. But then again, nowadays even a pen comes with an eraser. But what happens when you lose a child to someone who was drinking and driving with no chaser? Because the driver, she drove off and there was no one there to chase her. So the death of a child is what mocked her. Now she believes that her trauma was written in permanent marker. Because how can you ever come back from the death of a child you can't? But if you've ever lost one or know someone who did, please say that child's name out loud. See, you may not ever be able to erase permanent marker, but if you keep drawing, you will be able to see the full picture. It was written in the scripture, Luke 20, verse 36. Neither can they die anymore, for they are equal unto angels and are children of God, being the children of resurrection. Don't think of this trauma as your destruction. If you're going through something right now, it's just because your life is under construction. And that's when God is doing his best work. So just wait for instruction. So many times, we're so quick to move when God wants us to be still. We're so busy trying trying to run up when he has a way for us to go around the hill. If we would just stop, take a break, assess, and some time to heal. Allow him to move on us and his light will reveal the road in which we should take. Not to forget all that we've been through, but to finally get rid of his heartache. Because honestly, God, I can't take no more. I'm tired of feeling like I'm the only soldier that's fighting this war. I'm trying to build a relationship with you, but the devil is building rapport. So show me something. Something my eyes and my heart can believe in. Because I may not show on the outside, but on the inside, I'm bleeding. And yes, I know the irony of that statement, but don't think that I'm not in pain because my bleeding is not blatant. My pain is not for everyone to see. I don't want it to be what defines me, but sometimes I feel alone and I'm just waiting on someone to find me. And tell me that everything is going to be okay. I don't need a long, drawn-out lecture. I just need to know that everything is going to be okay. Those four simple words can be the words to save my day. I've been through so much trauma and it's all locked up inside of me. I swear, it felt like I was alone on Rikers Island, but I saw something different out on the horizon. I've been through all of this trauma, but look at me, y'all. I'm still smiling. So never lose your smile. It's the one thing that makes you special. You've got to learn to smile even when life gets stressful. Know that every smile is different, but we all smile the same. Your smile will be the one thing that help get you through your pain. So keep smiling, y'all. Keep smiling.